Yo, skippity doo. What's up, homies? Today I'm gonna show you how to use browser hacks on the newest firmware, which is currently 10.3.28. This is really awesome because browser hacks went away and now it's back. So if you want to get browser hacks working and boot homebrew, there's one thing that you have to do, like with all versions of homebrew, you have to prepare your SD card. I recommend deleting everything off your SD card if you're doing this from scratch, and then downloading the starter kit in the link here, and then just unzip it and drag every single file directly on your SD card. If you're using a new 3DS, um, it won't be as easy because you'll have to do it wirelessly or take your micro SD card out. I have some links in the description on how to do that, but that, those are really, really easy to do too. This technically works on every version of DS so far because there's a lot of, a couple different browser hacks method. The only thing you'll have to do is scan a QR code and it's going to check your DS and direct you to the correct browser hacks page. So after you have your SD card set up the way I said with the starter kit downloaded and put onto your SD card, uh, then you're just ready to go. So um, in your from your DS, just uh, click the L and R button at the same time and then see this little checkered button? Uh, that's the QR code scanner, just press that and then you're gonna want to scan a QR code and I'll, I'll, I'm gonna go ahead and put throw the QR code on the screen uh, I'm on a new 3ds XL so then just uh, select OK and then OK to launch your uh, internet browser obviously you'll need to have your internet connection set up to use this otherwise it's not gonna work and you'll see this this is on the newest firmware on a new Nintendo 3ds and it just boots up into homebrew so that's pretty simple if you have an older firmware version it might load a web page and if it does that what you'll need to do is like zoom in all the way and scroll to the top left hand corner of the screen and then you'll have to do something there'll be this like slider on the page I'm not going to explain all this in this video if you're using an old version I have a guide on how to do slider hacks so if that comes up and there's this little tiny page with a slider go down in the description and find click the slider links tutorial if your browser crashes and you just get an error message and it doesn't do anything uh, that means that you didn't set up your SD card correctly so just try putting your SD card back in or if you're on a new 3DS just delete everything on your card download the starter kit and put everything back on and try from scratch if you do this and it hangs and your bottom screen on your DS is just like a yellow screen that's okay every once in a while it doesn't work and it just hangs so just turn off your DS or your your two, 3DS 2DS whatever you got and try it again and it'll probably work if you're using a version of 2DS or 3DS that's less than 9 then it's recommended that you manually put in the URL to use browser hacks instead of using this QR code but that's at your own discretion and I doubt there's many of you with older versions I'll put a link in the description to go to every single browser hacks page and it'll show the firmware versions and everything I'm not gonna get into that right now but I just want to let you guys know that the browser hacks is back up and running it's working on the newest firmware if you like this video give it thumbs up and subscribe because you will love everything I do around here and um, also leave a comment if you guys don't know what's going on or you can't get it to work let me know I can try to help you out blah 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 yada 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 and uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time adios amigos sayonara salamander blah 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 blah